Hi guys! So today I'm gonna be doing a get ready with me. I'm actually gonna be doing a look that I sort of, well, it's not really like I planned, I sort of saw online and was like, ooh, that's cute. So I'm gonna do this look um, for 17's concert, Ode to You. And I haven't really practiced this look, but I thought I'd try it out anyways. So, first things first. I need to put my contacts on. I wasn't planning on wearing contacts for this look. I tried out these contacts and they're from Pinky Paradise and they are so comfortable and I actually really like them. But I could like go so long with wearing them. So we are going to put my contacts on. Um, right, before we start, I should mention I'm not really good at putting contacts in. Is it going in? No. It's fine until I start crying, then it's not fine. <laughs> okay, we got one in! Every time I've done it before, it has taken me a very long time. So, oh my god, god. <laughs> so the contacts I'm actually going to be wearing today are called Princess Pinky Cloudy Grey. And they are so nice. They make my eyes look great. Um, I love the grey color. It's not really too bold but also like not too subtle that it's not noticeable so i really really enjoy wearing this i will wear this like whenever i get the chance which is not often but i wear this whenever i can and like i love how it looks okay we're gonna try and put this in this may take a while see now i'd like to think that i have a lot of patience so I don't really get that frustrated when I can't get it in the first like 10 minutes. So, you know, it's fine. This is not a problem, it's fine. We're all good. I am so not used to the feeling of contacts touching my eyes. So I get like, I start tearing up so much. Okay, that was actually so much quicker than I thought. That was only six minutes. So this is the difference. This is the gray contact, clearly. Um, yeah, see, it's so nice. It really adds a nice touch to this. <laughs> Not to do the second half. Are any of you guys going to O2U Chicago? Because if you are, say hi if you see me. I got it. In what? Okay, it was definitely more than three minutes because some of it got cut out, but I finally got them in. Okay. Also, look at how cute these cases are. They're so cute. I think these are little. I have no idea what those are. But the the I also got blue ones, and look, they're like little bears. They're so cute. Um, the blue one that I got was called. So it's basically the same thing as the silver one. Um, it's just it's um. It's called Pinky Princess Cloudy Blue instead of Pinky Princess Cloudy Gray. Now that we have the contacts in, this is what they look like. We are going to start the makeup. So, I always do my eyebrows. Because um, my eyebrows are the most important. So, we're just gonna get started on these bad boys. I forgot to wipe my beauty blender. Haha, <laughs> and I forgot to tell you guys what eyebrows are. What eyebrow thing I used. <laughs> so I'm using the <laughs> Anastasia Beverly Hills, the brow powder duo. And I'm using the medium brown one. So as you can tell, I usually just use this side. And um, that's the only one I took I usually that's the only one I use for my eyebrows. I've been using it for like five years. I love it. And to conceal my brows, I use the NARS concealer in custard. So I usually just put this like under eyes, sort of the nose, forehead, and chin, and blend it out and it basically covers my whole face. <laughs> I 
Okay. There we go. Now, eyeshadow. Now, the hardest part. I don't have eye primer, so we are continue. We will continue to use um, my concealer. Okay, so I am going to be using the Morphe palette. I'm not exactly sure which one this is. This is not mine. I don't know, have I opened this? Oh, there we go. So this is the palette. We are gonna go in with this shade right here, this pink one. And we're just gonna go like over like the crease. I don't know makeup terms. So because my eyelids, they're like very oddly, like they have really weird folds, this shape is gonna be like the way I do my eyeshadow is gonna be very different from how I do this one just because if I do them the same and I keep my eyes open it's not gonna look the same after <laughs> so I think this looks from what I can remember I think this is okay <laughs> So I think, bear with me now, I think I went in with this color right here and sort of just tried to define my crease. I think. We are getting somewhere. I hope so. So I'm gonna be using Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance, pa Renaissance Palette. And I'm gonna be going in with Love Letter. I'm gonna be using that Love Letter. And um, I'm not sure how to say that, but this one. This, this, this one right here. It looks like a lot, but don't worry, it will all come together, I promise. Next up is to cut the crease, which I have never done by myself before, so this will be fun. So this is the progress right now, we've cut the crease. And now, we are going to go in with another pink. This look is going to be very, very pink. Oh, right, I don't even know <laughs> the shade that we're using for it to fill in the this area. We're going to go with this pink right, right here. So after this, we have to blend this area right here where it goes from the light area to the dark you have to blend that a bit we are going to use this and we're gonna go back in with this shade right here and we're just gonna sort of blend the two together okay so i think i blended it as much as I could. There, you can still sort of see where it like starts and ends, but I think for the most part, it's pretty blended, sort of. Okay. And for the most important part of this look, the glitter. So I'm just gonna quickly go over this cut area right here, just, just the line. Just gonna go over that quickly with this glitter.
This is the difference. I don't know if you guys could tell it's a, if it's like a huge difference, but I really like it. So this is no glitter and this is with the glitter. I personally really love glitter. I forgot to mention that this is um, Urban Decay's Heavy Metal Glitter Eyeliner. It's so nice. I think this eye ended up looking a lot better. I mean, it's still not perfect because of the shape of the lid, but I think this eye is pretty good. Ooh, that looks cute. Okay. We're going somewhere with this. We have that done and we have to do the eyeliner, which is the most stressful part. And I hate to bring this up again, but it's the uneven eyes. If I start my eyeliner here, let's, let's just say we start the eyeliner here on this eye and we try to start it at the same level, it's not, it's not gonna be the same. With eyeshadow, it's even harder because I cannot clean up any mistakes I make. So, this will be fun. So for eyeliner, I stole Amy's because mine is running out, but we both have the same. We have the we have the Fenty Beauty Eyeliner. It's so nice. I love using this. It's amazing. Okay. Complete silence for the eyeliner. Okay, I think this is the closest I'll get to them looking sort of pretty much very similar. So I'm just, I'm, I'm gonna leave it. I'm not gonna touch it because if I feel like I feel like if I touch it, I'm just gonna mess it up. And now, lashes. Okay, one eye down, but not to the other eye. <laughs> Okay, so I got the second lash on. That was a little bit harder, but I got it on. Um, how do I feel like there's something else that I am missing? I need to curl them. Let's put on some mascara. And I like to use the Too Faced Better Than Sex. It does wonders. So my lashes, they tend to fall very quickly, so I have to constantly like push them up or constantly keep curling them or they're gonna just, you know? I should do contour, except I forgot my contour brush. Okay, so I think, I think I'm pretty much done. Obviously, I'm gonna do other stuff like on the day of the like contour, highlight, all that stuff, but as of right now, I don't have that on me. I was mainly just, oh wait, no, I am not done. I just remember I have another palette sitting here, Urban Decay, Naked Reloaded. And I was like, why do I have this sitting beside me? And I realized I have one last sparkle to add. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to take the Angel Fire right there. And you can see them. Okay, I'm gonna take the Angel Fire right here. And I'm just gonna put them on the inner corners of my eyes just to like, you know, add a little pop to all this. So I don't know if you could tell if that made much of a difference, but I add some sparkle right here on the inner corners of my eye. And I think that is the whole look. Yeah, so this is the whole look. I think that's pretty much everything. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. I hope you guys look forward to my vlog when I go to Chicago for 17's concert. I will definitely vlog just the trip in Chicago and I'm also gonna vlog the concert itself. So I hope you guys look forward to that. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe.